all car club plaques. This is insane. Incredible collection. There's a bunch of stuff in the way, but that's all right. Just keeps going and going and going. Asphalt monsters. And it just keeps going and going and going. Tons of them. Look at those missiles. Bombs. So these big pieces of metal are covering it. Most of them, but you kind of still see. Wish I could do a video without all this stuff in the way, but it's kind of it is how it is right now. We got more on this side. Man, I wish all this stuff wasn't in the way, but it's really something. Crazy cool collection. Redwood Kings, sedans, rod rockers. Playboys. So over the years, if I'm not mistaken, those filing cabinets are all full of more plaques to later be put up all over here. But I've got some welders in here now. But man. Not gonna walk under the ladder. I don't need any bad luck. But <laughs> on the ceiling too. Jeez. No club lone wolf. That's a cool one. No club. Boy, is that neat. Why is all this stuff in the way? Oh man. Stackers, <laughs> Saint Sinners, Time Travelers, Sidewinders, Golden Rotters. We got the Outcasts, Knuckle Busters. Oh boy. More on the door. Wow.
Nice toilet. What's that? That is chariots. That's kind of a unique one. Aristocrats. Love those cabinets. Got in here. Oh, it's locked. I feel like these are all full of clacks too. Got my feet. That's good. What's up y'all, back with another one. So what is a car club plaque, really? And it's something I didn't even know was a thing till a couple of years ago. You know, they're kind of like license plates. They're shaped like license plates, you know, metal rectangle. But 
Uh, it was something that they did back in uh, the 50s, 60s, and 70s for your different car club. And from what I've heard, you know, uh, kids in metal shop in high school used to make them out of cast aluminum or cast, you know, whatever metal that they would use. And pretty much it became like a thing that you could put on your car to distinguish, you know, what club you're in, kind of just for like bragging rights. So as far as I'm concerned, you know, there's two different types of car club plaques. There are the uh, low rider plaques and then just the, the normal square ones. Um, but pretty cool, pretty neat thing. Uh, went over to my buddy's place. He's got thousands of these things all on his wall. He's got an incredible collection. Uh, I just can't believe it. And it was a whole it's a it's a whole piece of the subculture that just I didn't even I wasn't even aware of. But um <clears throat> they're pretty cool uh something uh you know kind of getting into i got a, a little collection myself uh going right now i got some up on ebay and every once in a while if you've watched the videos you know i'll, I'll see them out at the swap meet and when i they're a good price you know i'll grab them but they're just so cool um someday you know what was that someday i will probably have a wall like that myself you know with all my plates and plaques and stuff but I'm kind of just, you know, once I get a good garage that I know I'm going to have for a while, I'm just going to hang up all my cool stuff. So hopefully y'all enjoy that one. You learned something new. Um, yeah, leave a like. Uh, hopefully y'all enjoyed. Peace.